Hello everyone and welcome to Festus Slash's first ever oh, Let's Play on Estangela Patio. I thought I'd not cover the um, maps since they've been overlooked by other YouTubers, pretty big ones too. And obviously I'm not the biggest at 18 subscribers at this t at the recording of the video, which okay, we are in a Estangela Patio, so this is, if you didn't know, this is the um, map that was from the FS17 Platinum Edition. Um, there used to be a really good house here, and you, you can still get it as a main farmhouse, but it's not that detailed anymore. Like, even this garage here, here you used to be able to put the this roller door down in 17, you can't. You can even open this door. It's changed that much anyway. Our account's 1.2 million and 500,000. So let's let's just have a look here. So I'm thinking about paddock 10 or field 10, wherever you come from. That's 251,000. So we'll just probably get knocked off at a to down at a million. Yeah, nine nine hundred and ninety-eight thousand four hundred eighty dollars. So now we've got that over there. Now, I'll, what about tractors? This is the thing. I I won't go too big yet. Like, for example, I won't go and get the ideal. Although it's a pretty good... Surprising... Like, I haven't seen it at Henty Field Days yet, which is, like, the biggest machinery field day in Australia. But, yeah. Well, it has to be Massive Ferguson one, because I don't think they'll ever bring the Fent version out here. But, yeah. Send the massive Fergs and run drive along the road a couple of times. So yeah, it's good. Uh, now let's look for a tractor. Like, I really want something that I haven't used yet. Like, I'm looking at this N series because I haven't used it. T5 I haven't used. I haven't used that Star either. So, yeah, I'll just go. I'll just have a look at this tractor. Like, it's 145 horsepower. And, yeah, we'll probably... Uh, what about a 154E? That's probably... That gets us to 165 horsepower, which... We we might be okay with that, actually. Uh, now, let's just... um. Okay, reels. No cans... No, we don't want communal ties or... Okay. I think we might... I think I might see if I can have... The... Yes. Yes, we do have the option to put the weights. It, it's inside the real rims. Yeah, I wish in this game you could actually get ballast in the tires. Like, have a tire option for ballast. Which makes the tractor heavier. Like my 35 does. Yes. Uh, okay, now let me just... Ooh. Oh, no, not Dirk's Far Green. I wanted a John Deere Green. Okay. John Deere Green. And now... Pink Reels. Yes. I'll make... This will make people say, What are those? What are those? Anyway, let's buy it. Oh, yeah, I'll yeah, it doesn't look too bad to me, actually. Yeah, so I think that in real life, people in the dealership think I'm crazy. Well, I am in real life, so there's no difference there. Okay, let me buy more stuff. Okay, so we've bought some stuff now, so I've decided to buy this Kramer here. I thought it was um a pretty good machine to have around here for loading up. The machine next door, which is the Starlight Imperinder of 3.0. So, yeah, I thought I might as well have this since it um, was part of the collect oh, not Collector's Edition, Platinum Edition for FS17. So, yeah, yeah. It's a shame we haven't got the Massey Ferguson one. I'm, I'm hoping that they'll release the 4709 Massey Ferguson tractor as a mod. So, yes. Then we've got this cedar here. 
um, but this is our cultivator and this is our header harvester combined whatever you want to call it and actually I don't think we'll be working that too much if we don't have a header for it yes I think I think that would be helpful so yes okay well I'm back and I just loaded up the sigil and yeah listen to the sound of this loader Okay, here we are, ladies and gentlemen. We are in the paddock now, and I just figured out it was grass. I don't have the grass thing turned on, so it'll turn up like a blank paddock, but there we go. It's grass. It's all green now. So now what I'll probably do is I don't think we'll have much room, so I think we'll build the yard area here. Like we've got, I don't know... We really don't need another tractor because we're... Although... What about for contracting jobs? Let's get a tractor for a contracting job. And, like, contracting missions or... Con what about... I'm thinking about one of these. One of these tractors here. We probably... I probably might get a um spray on the back or something. Like, I've got a save game that happens to be a Santa Apache as well. Uh, yeah, I'm, yeah, I want to get this tractor with the front loader and, like, a spray on the back so then I can go around. Okay, so, I think I might put no cans on there. And we want to attach it for that. Okay, so, uh, what else do we need? We Now, since I've put the front loader, I might as well get that so this is it JCB yellow which that is and I think I'll just stay with the standard black color on this because I don't even think we really need the tines to be yellow so we'll just have a look at the contracting page and see what's here transporting bailing I think that's too much equipment harvesting and fertilizing. I think that's what we might get for the um, JCB, the fast track. A fertilizer spreader. One of these. Although. Oh, I'm trying to think here. Should we. Yeah, we've got bigger capacity with these. But yeah, this is good enough. Like, this is. Okay, this tractor I might use to cart stuff, get rid of some stuff. That Shipping containers, which seem to be very small. Yeah, it's about almost tall as us. But yeah, they'll probably be allowed at least to there. Or no, maybe maybe a little bit lower, but yeah, they're certainly not this small. Well, the one that's outside my window in the room where I can't the video here. Next time if you will see this paddock in the next video, it should be all ready to harvest or I don't know, but it won't certainly be still being drilled. But anyway, this is Festus Slasher and I hope you have enjoyed the video so yeah, smash that like button, comment, and if you want to ask a question about anything, about, I don't know, Daggerin, well, I don't know much about him, about myself, just anything, okay, bye for now.